Hello everyone and welcome back to a new episode of Witchwood. If you enjoyed the series, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below. Let us get a gnome hat. A gnome! You've been gnomed! <laughs> I think they were over here, right? Is a crow. I am going to collect some more of this because I think I am actually running low. I don't think I ever used the changeling route for anything. I wonder if that is like accurate to like actual like folklore about changelings if they do just look like root. A puzzle box. A puzzle box. Oh, oh she should have so I need to go to the docks. But this is what the changeling root is for, so that's that's good time. So I actually need to go to the docks so if I can get that. Okay. So, I might as well just, like, go to ever. Actually, I do need more milk. Can I make more of these? I can. Make so many of these. So many. So many jars, because I need milk for cats. That was weird. That, uh, that tripped me out. Cow up here. Cow's up here. I do need more clay though. That should be enough. That should be enough. Now I need to go to the docks, because I need stuff that I remember. Oh, they, they actually... Okay, so I don't think they were meant to be in the line. I think it glitched. Because, uh, originally they weren't in the line. I thought that's just how they were meant to be. But, uh... Looks like they weren't meant to be like that. Fishman! The Deep One! Not quite a fish, not quite a man. Something from the bats! Crap! A crap trap. Unknown and shields. Missionary of the line. What were you? A sandpiper! It's a little sandpiper. He be not quite a fish, not yet a man. Oh, how'd you? Fishing spot. Oh, I love this place. Oh, this place is great. I love it. Oh, she shot. That's one of the things I needed. Passes by the same shot of another collection of crusty barnacles, dinging to the surface of a stone until the tide makes surges. But you can spot the inconsistencies, the irregularities in the scattered arrangement. With a single good, exacting touch, the illusion falls away. Oh, and bomb yourself, it's okay, cool. Ah! A shell skill. This fish seems to have skipped a few evolutionary steps. And it does. Huh. 
For. For what? Barnacles! Did you know in correlation to body size, the barnacle has the largest penis compared to any other item? Treats. I'm gonna make fucking three of those. Uh, unknown recipe. Interesting. Crab trap. Oh, I need to make the uh, more of these. I'm gonna need like a lot of these, so I might as well just make a whole bunch. More snap traps. Oh, these are these are unknown recipes. I did not put two and two together. Oh, the short skipper also needs a crab trap. <laughs> Crab Claw. What did? Yeah, the title, title, title. This is a soothing room. Arcane forms to calm the distressed and set to. Pain so ease, useful against weeping spectrums. And this, I need that. And oh, tidal texture. Whatever that is. Which is up here. Ah, the wheel of water. Ah, oh, I don't have any water. Oh, I should have picked up some water. Can I get water from here? Doesn't look like it. I'll have to have to pick up some some water. A shiny stone. Make fishing. Doesn't. I should be able to, but I guess I just haven't figured out the right recipe for it. This requires this, which I can make. Uh, and it requires. This, which also needs wow, so I need like two, two water for that. Ch 
child. Excuse me, can you spare the seashells and the try to along the beach, but everyone else always gets to them before I can. She points along the shoreline where you can see shores of fishermen digging in the sand. Every so often, one of them scumbles a seashell and rejoices a bit more gold nugget. Seashells. What's the big deal with seashells? The little girl looks down the docks to a particularly large ship at anchor. See that big boat over there? Does the captain. He was supposed to come ashore and tell him all about his adventures on the high seas like he always does. He hasn't come out since they docked. So I tried to go and see him. But there's a grouchy sailor who says I can't go inside the boat because I got she shares. So I tried to find some. But now everyone else is trying to find them too. There's not enough left for me. Mmm. Sounds fishy, alright. You stay here, little one. Let me have a chat with the sailor and get to the bottom of this. Really? Better listen to a grown like you. I promise I won't move a muscle. Uh, a muscle. It's a, it's a, it's a clam joke. Oh, there. Where do you think you are but enough to? Me? Well, I've come to visit my uh son. No, uh, no, yeah. The only family anyone on this tub has is the sea yourself. And no one gets aboard just to pay the toll and sea shells first. What's a gold brain shrubby like you want with a bunch of dirty shells? Taint for me, the captain got his own business with them shells. And I ain't one to question him. And she either ring me your dues or cast off. Ring me sea shells, the nice kind too. When's the sun like the ocean waves? I don't know where to find seashells. I just kind of found one in a chest. Hmm. I should know. I fished one. I fished one up, didn't I? Is that what I did? I don't remember. I should know. I bet. I bet they have seashells. Ah! Double crab! Fisherman. Wait, he's actually a fish man. The fish people, I just realized. I love it here. No, I haven't, I haven't dug up anyone. To the market! Okay. Oh yeah, went to the village. I haven't been to the market. Chicken. Man, the game just feels like it went from... Being so little to just being massive. You elbow your way to the front of a crowd that has gathered to absorb a three way shouting match, a trio of merchants yelling wildly at each other. You treacherous fiend! It was you that stuck into my shop and put me worms in my bread. Worms, you think I have time to trap sprout, you silly little beggar? Let me show you stay in my smithy. Firecrackers in my coal. I could have lost an eye. Chandler? You would have deserved it, you traitor. I know you ruined a whole batch of my candles with that sulfur stunt. Now my store smells like a mule's behind. The men launched themselves at one another, fist swinging in a whirling melee. The cat did it. Off in the shadows, you catch a stealthy figure watching the chaos with a delighted grin. <laughs> dance, dance, all the idiots prance. With a freak of her tail, the feline disappears through the maze of market stalls. What's all this commotion about? A dull and monotonous voice. Sad unicorn, no! A monotonous voice drums out across the square and reply, Don't you know the worst of it? <laughs> Tell me, sad unicorn. 
seconds to repose, this tragic creature raises its tear-filled eyes at you. Despite its depressing appearance, you find yourself somehow feeling lighter. But on Earth is a rainbow spirit doing in the midst of a mocked brow. Thought you kind thrived on nerve and sunshine and all that kind of sappy drivel. Oh, sure. Normally this mock is a wonderful place to be. But lately it's been nothing but misery and unless. Just look around. When I see your three little brats puffing out their chests and barking like mutts. Surely our hot meal and a good night's rest would cool their heads. I'm afraid it goes deeper than that. You see all sorts of awful things have been happening. Vandalism in folks' gardens, trash in the wells, wagon wheels tampered with, rumors spreading like wildfire about this or that, cheats and lies. Now, I'm usually the one who keeps the peace around here with my trusty magic horn, makes the truth flow and keeps folk honest. But with all this deception and treachery in the air, it's as limp as a noodle. My powers are useless. Yes, Tesk, a trippy horn is no laughing matter. If you had a bit of a pick-me-up, do you suppose you could get this place under control? Sure, sugar. Just need to get some of my strength back. Good snack to puck you right out. A rainbow roll? I want a rainbow roll. It needs dough and a glitter bomb. This needs milk. I don't need milk, really. Man, I should have made some new cat stuff. Ah, it's the goose who laid the golden egg. Need to deal with that goose first. Fortunately, I can't. I heard a rat, but I didn't see a rat. A cow. Okay, I can make the dough now. What else does this need? And a glitter bomb. I don't see a crafting folklore bomb. Ah, here it is. Oh shit, I make two bags now. I need more clay. Get your tasty dessert. Is is this for me? It troubles me to see a benevolent beast afflicted by such melancholy. And the quicker that horn of yours works, the quicker we can sort out this mess. Throwing back its head, the unicorn swallows the odd confection without even chewing. The spots on its back glow a soft lavender, and its hooped feet to levitate off the ground for just a moment. From above, a thin sliver of sunlight breaks through the clouds and Sparkles off the unicorn's horn, momentarily blinding you in a dazzling flash. When you look back, the unicorn is happily wagging its tail at you. Its horn looks reinvigorated with a pearlescent sheen. Ah, that hit the spot. Looks like the old truth detector is working again. Well, what are you waiting for? Blast those fools! The unicorn lowers its horn and takes aim at the feuding shopkeepers. A long moment passes as the unicorn body quivers with anticipation. Um, wait, I swear this never happens. My powers were all charged up, but none of them are actually lying. So they really didn't sabotage each other's businesses, then? My horn will only be able to blast the lies out of someone who's truly false. As far as they know, they're each telling the truth. Hmm, which means someone else must be responsible for this mess. The feuding shopkeepers run out of insults to hurl each other, and all storm back to the business in a huff. I'll go investigate the scenes of the crimes of the shops. 
Maybe I can turn up some clues. I I kind of already knew that. You know, just by putting two and two together. Not this time. I feel like I should do something about this. You know, obviously the cat did it, but I feel like I had to do that part in order to do the rest. A great offering of produce is before the SF team, but you glimpse that as a single telltale marker secreted into one of the baskets. A quick tug and the illusion is suspended. Ah. Uh... Oh, why? That's strange. It feels strange to me that the portal has an, a weakness. Let him suffer, but make it. I'll tear his nose off next time I see him. Settle down, Master Chandler. You're being duped by a prankster. Ah, a prankster. He was that baker, I'm sure of it. Don't see no evidence to the contrary. You want evidence, eh? I bet there's a clue around here that wouldn't fail the real truth. Get me, get some evidence, or get out! Cat's confession. Tiny cauldron. I love it, it's so cute. Oh, okay. This bag smells suspiciously of sulfur and has a shipping address stamped on it. Pier 3, Inport Stockyards. Okay, so I gotta go there. Oh, I see he made candles out of rodent lard. Oh, that's disgusting. Pocket thing. No, I need I need to go to the graveyard before I can do that. That's a minute. Make it till you make it. What what? That's old fresh blacksmith just grinds my gears. I ought to give him a smack on the brow next I see him. Master Baker, please, set her down. You've been tricked. Ha, ah, very much doubt that. Only a fool would believe that story without any evidence. Fine, you want the evidence? I'll get you some. The true criminal must have left clues around here somewhere. Okay, so I need the cat's con confession before. I can actually... Uh, Anything. A strange face, doesn't look like it belongs in the bakery, and there's still some bugs and dirt inside. An description on the sign reads Held Grimes, 17 something to 17 something. Hanged under the old grave tree for crimes he never committed. Oh, oh, that's a body. Ugh. I feel like he would notice that, like, honestly. A cooking pit? Workers only. Oh, okay, so this is like a light old thing. So that that's actually a path to someone else, but I haven't unlocked it yet. So that's probably what happened to like me not going to like this area. Oh, I figured I could have went in there. I want that golden egg. Just 
No, just taking a shit. Our that blessed Chandler, a ring his scrawny neck. Calm yourself, Master Blacksmith. You're being played for a fool. Ha! Ah, fat chance. Only some hard evidence could ever convince me that it wasn't that bludgering knave. Someone really has been sneaking around in here. There ought to be some clues left behind. Some fireworks have been hastily shot into this coal barrel. A tag on the fireworks would be property of town watch if lost please return to the village gallows. So let's let's go back to the village first, I guess. Yeah, that must be like the last the last place, I guess. Where did I just come out of? To the village. To the village. It's actually not this way. It's actually the other way. Can I go this one? Kitty. Kitty, I have a thing for you. A cat hairball. Good kitty. Oh, this is where I can get water. Oh, that's so nice. with evidence, storage, and parade and decorations, including a box of dusty fireworks. An errant note catches your eye, which can quite fit your hand through the wooden planks. Drat, I need something thin and grabby. Oh, I need... That's what I figured I needed. Okay. Do I have any more shiny thingies? It doesn't look like it. So, I can actually go... I can actually go back to the uh, the farm. Oh, actually, I need clay first, so for my pots. Because uh, I only have one thing of water, and this needs. Multiple. Yeah, because this needs that last bit over here, and this needs water as well, which means I need more jugs. I need more clay because I've actually run out of clay. It doesn't seem to be any place to get clay from here. Unfortunately. So I should need to go to the forest to get clay. In the well, because the well seems to be the only place that really gives you clear. That is going to be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment down below. And I will see you all next time.